Hi everyone, this is Life Issue and this is Blessing. Thank you so much for coming to my channel. I did say I was going to come back again with another interesting story that is going viral. All right, so if you've not subscribed to our channel, please help me hit the red button. If you're watching me from Facebook, please help me follow on my page. All right, so another story and on this video i'm doing it because of social responsibility another ghana pastor threatening his wife because she demanded for him to sign a divorce paper now why am i doing this i have to do this because the last time that a pastor a ghana pastor the video went viral. I saw that video and I did not do that video. That is a foray. And before we know it, that man killed his wife. And now he is in prison on murder charges, okay, in the US. So I, when I saw this video, I told myself, you know what? I need to put that video out there. We need to broadcast this. We need to get people in the US talking and get the FBI or the police involved in this because this is how it starts. The man tells you, I'm going to kill you. I'm going to destroy you. And before you know it, it happens. Now, if you've not seen that viral video, I'm going to show you the video. Then we'll come and talk about what people are saying. And we'll talk about marriages and what to do when you find out that your marriage is actually broken down. There is no way going forward. Do you need to confront that person? Do you just need to get a third party who is not even a family to medicate? Or even to get a lawyer, what should we do? All right, let's watch this video. I'm going to be sharing my screen now for you to watch the video before we talk about the video. All right, so I'm screen sharing. Do, 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 do. All right, so watch this video. I'm going to start from the beginning so you can watch it from the beginning. All right, start. Oh, dear. Yeah. Oh, how was happened? All right, watch this. Full screen, watch. Uh, this is really breaking just between you and us after everything I'm gonna... I'm gonna try to download this because it's really breaking I don't know why it's not showing. Okay, let me try and download it, then I'll play it for you because it keeps um, breaking. Hopefully, it's better when I download it. Well, you can hear the woman talking about after everything she's done for him. So, um, yeah, let's watch this now. Hopefully, it's better. Do 
that's my own children. So I don't have the right to file the work. I have the right. I have the right. What the that would be treating me? What if you know? You don't care. You don't care. Okay. You know you had a marriage. The wife that you never, she never signed it. Divorce. Who sent that person out there, Kono? Or so for two times for say yes. So what is this? When you this people, what is this? What is this? Let me hear. Any, any. So why did you say it's with a lawyer? I'm not a lawyer. Oh, this is the original one. With the original one. The original one with the. I worry. I worry. I sacrifice. Yeah, try it. 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 No. Yeah, this is a bit. Yeah, no. Yeah, it was two pieces. Let him out. I'm not going to talk with you if you have a CCR. No, 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 no. Where is the other one? Okay, where is the angle? This, this is, you gave two of them. I don't trust. I don't trust. This is, this is, where, 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 because one for the other money in bulk. No, 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 Oh my God, he said it. I will bury you. my god guys did you guys just watch what i just watched now oh my god the man actually i don't know what happened i don't know how he got this bad but that was a threat to the woman's life and also the woman also threatened the man's life because the woman said you will die before you leave this country but the man said she will be buried um i was watching that video and i was telling myself how do we allow a relationship to get this bad without doing something? Why should anybody allow a relationship to get this bad? If it's not working, just sign the paper. I mean, why was the man insisting on not signing the paper? Um, it is bad, it's bad. There were children there watching everything that was going on. And, and I'm like, why do you need this to get this bad? It's not working. Sign the paper. Don't let the devil push you. Like this person said, don't let the devil push you. The woman has made up of mind. She's leaving. She brought you to America. 
She said she gave you her um, green card. She's been taking care of you. You're a pastor. Why do you let things get this bad? If it's not going to work, if both of you has broken down that there's no communication, why hold on to the marriage? You already have your green card. She doesn't want, from the look of things, her family is there, they want to kick you out, just go. Mind the things that you say, mind the anger, especially if you're a pastor. I keep talking about office of a pastor. There is a way to carry yourself if you're a pastor that things that shouldn't easily come out of your mind, mouth, or you shouldn't even think about it. You, they were children, I, I could see, you know, I could see the children watching them. And I'm like, think about the psychological effect that this will have, you know, what will happen to the children, how it will affect your children. Do you need to go through this, you know, um, open confrontation? She, The paper had been with you. The lawyer wants the paper. Why didn't you sign? She doesn't want any more. Why do we hold on to? You see, the Western world is not like Africa. The Western world is structured in such a way that you cannot intimidate a woman. You cannot. If she doesn't want to, she doesn't want to. And there is nothing you can do about it. Okay, you cannot say, I cannot. You will have to. And now you've made a threat. And because of the fact that there is already a Ghanaian man that killed his wife after making a threat, the, the police will go come into this. If this video gets to their hands, they will get this guy for interrogation. They will start monitoring him. People, we need to mind what we say. We need to mind, you know, the way we behave when we are in this part of the world. It's not Africa. Africa, the men get away with things. And also the women. I had the woman, you know, talking about the fact that she's done this, she's done that, she's, you know, she gave him green card, she gave him paper. And I'm like, he's your husband. You, both of you were married, so who else would give him the paper? You married him. You brought him to America. So it's not, you're not doing anything big. It's what you're supposed to do as a wife. And if the relationship has broken down for a reason, you need to tell the whole world, why do you even need to send this video? Why do you need to circulate, um, circulate it for us to talk about? But why do we talk about this? We talk about this, uh, someone out there will learn. All these things, first of all, is not necessary. When a relationship is broken down, when it has gotten this bad, that, that we, it, you cannot reconcile, please sign the paper. Don't start threatening the woman. Don't start thinking about killing her. It's not worth it. It's not what you being in prison. It's not what you're losing your life. Your children shouldn't pass through their mom being taken and you in prison. So if it's broken, it's broken. Just let the let, let the relationship go. And women, I know that, you know, sometimes it's not what we want or what we expect that comes to us, but that's what marriage is. That's what marriage is. You don't always get what you want. I, I had people, you know, there were people um talking on the background someone else from another family coming into your family matter because you guys let it be you guys can actually separate amicably without someone else coming into it just sign the paper we don't need this okay and i'm going to read what people are saying on social media because sometimes when you see where nigerians or what nigerians are saying um you know someone just said bros don't you know <laughs> Bros don't take don't don't want bro don't want to depart from his looks. You can tell he's very lazy and he's you know we don't know if he's lazy. We don't know if he's not working. That he's a pastor doesn't mean that he's lazy. He could be working and still be a pastor. We don't have all the whole details. I I would get the fact that some people become pastors and they don't want to work and they are home and they are being lazy, but not everybody. I don't think any woman in the Western world would take that because we know the jobs are there. Even, even if it means him, for him to go and sweep the floor, let him go and sweep the floor. But we don't know the story. So we can't just conclude that because he's a pastor, he is gonna, he's, he's lazy. I person say, but can families have their issues in private without bringing it us? Yeah, that's what we keep saying, you know. 
if you don't put this stuff out there, we won't blog about it. If you don't upload it, we won't have any content. We don't have anything to talk about. But when you upload it, we'll talk about it because we want people to learn from your mistakes or what you've done. So they didn't need to. If they wanted to show this to the police, they should just go ahead and show it to the police, not upload it. So what are they trying to do? The, their children's picture was there. We saw the children's face. The man's face is there. So the people who don't even, who don't even know what was going on in that family now knows he must have gone home to Ghana. People don't know. I mean, we don't need all this. Can we just try to solve our family problem in house without other people knowing? And I'm going to say it again: you can separate from your partner without much ado, without much force. It's not going to go work. It's not going to work. You guys can be friends and think about how you can raise your children. At the end of the day, is the children that matters. It's not both of you. If it's not going to work, it's not going to. Why? Why live in a marriage or why stay in a marriage? That is not going to work out. It's only back home that we do that. We just stay in that marriage. Oh, the man is killing us. The woman, we just stay, we stay, stay, stay. No, we shouldn't be doing that in the Western world. All right, guys, I just saw this video and I just wanted to put it out there so that people who know, if you know them, you need to be, you know, following up on this woman because there's a threat on her life. The man has said he's going to kill her, bury her. Um... People are talking, Ghana people are talking about this, the Nigerian people are talking about it, and they're talking about marriage wahala. Yeah, I mean, nobody said marriage is a bed of rose. I mean, to be frank with you, marriage really is not a bed of rose. Nobody ever said it. Anybody tells you that once you marry, everything is okay. Your life is the... No, 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 no. Marriage is not a bed of rose. Sometimes you open it is rosy. Sometimes it cannot be. You know, every time is it rosy, but you you know what? That's why we're Christians. That's why we have God. That's why we pray. I mean, as as you get older, old wine becomes much more, you know, finer and refined. So, um, I'm just gonna put this out there, just for us to know what has happened. If you know this family, if you are their friends, they need you need to put them in your prayer, and for us out there, any young person out there please 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 if that marriage is not working if there is no way you guys can solve your problem if it's broken down to the extent that, that it's not repairable sign the paper there is no need holding on to a marriage that one party has said she doesn't want anymore now on a lighter mood i'm going to put this here a man decided to do an advert <laughs> oh my god asking another man mr abi lotunde a native of ondo state to stop sleeping with his wife you will die on top of how be one and then he posted the mass oh my god the man's phone number and it just got me cracking when i saw this and i'm like I mean, this is love anyway, for you to even know that your wife is sleeping with somebody else and you are still don't mind and you are wanting the man. Some men would have just left the man and run away, but you still love your wife and you want that man to stop. Mr. Tundebiko, please leave this man's wife before he goes native on you. I mean, marriage, marriage. Marriage can be beautiful, but the point is that once it's broken down, it's broken down. We don't need all this. We don't need this, okay? If a woman is not interested, if a woman has made up her mind that she does not want to be in a marriage, why shook your head into it? Why insist that she must be in it? Why do you need to put an advert and one of another man from your wife when the woman obviously is disrespecting your vow She's not really into you anymore and she's sleeping with another man. Why would a man take that? I don't know. I, I've never seen this work, kind of one before. All right, guys, thank you so much for watching. Just bringing this video and this news to you so that you'll be aware of what is happening. Ghana people, please, 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 if you know this couple, um, just talk to them and please calm the pastor down, okay? He's a pastor. He needs to understand that people are watching him. If he has a congregation, what is he going to be preaching on Sunday? 
what would he be preaching to them? Mm, I know why he doesn't want to sign is because he doesn't want to be called a divorcee pastor. But is it better than for him to kill the woman? I mean, sometimes you just need to let go. All right, guys, thank you so much. Make sure you subscribe. Make sure you like. And if you are on my page, please make sure you follow. God bless you. Bye-bye.